this video, we'll be showing you how to set up your audio controls on the Creator Central app. Let's take a look at your microphone settings. Click on the DSP tab to configure microphone settings and effects. The Livestreamer AX310 supports both dynamic and condenser microphones. If you're using a dynamic microphone, select XLR 0 volts from drop-down menu. If you're using a condenser microphone or using a cloud lifter, they'll require phantom power. So you have to select XLR plus phantom power 48 volts from the drop-down menu. Make sure you, that you're using a condenser microphone before turning this on to avoid any damage to your microphone. If you're connecting something through the 6.3mm jack, select that from the drop-down menu. From here, you can set your microphone's gain. To turn on or off microphone monitoring, you can click on the headset icon next to the mic volume slider on the mixer tab or use the monitor widget. On the right side, you will find all the effects that can be used on your microphone. All these effects are being processed on the AX310 itself, not on the Creator Central app. So you will not have any latency with the effects applied. You can switch through different DSP effects, enable them and tweak them to your liking. Now let's take a look at the physical knobs for mic control and mixer functions. First, head on over to the mixer tab to toggle between single mix and dual mix. In single mix, the mic knob will control the volume on your headset, the chat mic going to your voice chat, and the mic audio on the mix that is going to your streaming software. With dual mix enabled, you'll have two independent audio mixes providing two different audio mixes for you, the creator, and your audience. The creator mix is a mix that you will listen to on your headset connected to the AX310. The audience mix is a mix that will go out to your stream. Gain and microphone effects will stay the same between these two, but the volume levels will be different. This is the creator mix, the mix that goes out to the headset. And this is the audience mix, the mix that goes out to the live stream. For the creator mix, we've only added console gameplay. We're not listening to any music at all, we want to focus on our game. However, for the audience mix, we've added music and we added a little bit of the audio from the console, but not that much. As you can hear, there are two different levels for each mix. One thing to note while in the dual mix mode is that the creator mix mic knob will control mic volume on the headset and the chat mic going onto your voice chat. You can still choose to turn mic monitoring on or off using the monitor widget or by clicking on the monitor icon next to the mic volume slider. When you switch over to the audience mix, the mic knob will be controlling the mic volume on your headset and your streaming software, but not the chat mic audio going to your voice chat. And that's it. You're ready to use the AX310 to control all your audio devices. Now head on over to our hotkey and widget setup video so that you can learn how to customize your control center. That's it from me today. Until our next video, stay safe and happy creating.